This is re-machine clean up exercise. So before you start this exercise, make sure you copy this CTF file into your working folder. You can right click, select save target as, save it into your working folder. Then go to file, unpack, we unpack the file. And then this will change to Vida folder history and select your file to save the unpack file. And then we uh, open open the file, we load this. Okay, we open here and you go to the motion parameter uh, under the two trajectory here. Now the machine regions we are select the split horizontal or vertical. So just cancel it. Mm. So you can see uh, that the layers seem uh, to be redundant. And then we go to navigator. Mm, this we use by vertical or horizontal. So you can see this. Okay, and then we copy this procedure, we edit it, um, this, uh, no. we change uh, this one slope limit angle to 55, oh sorry. And then we right click, select, save, and calculate. So this is the result. This is how to control the slope angle. Okay, next is about the all 3D step. This is the new option in Simatron E10. Uh, so we edit this procedure. We change the machine region here. Change to all along. After that, uh, we check this one. Create auxiliary control. After that, uh, we execute it. And then we hide the bar, uh, hide the posterior, uh, the two path. So you can see the result. Okay, and then we copy this procedure. And we edit this and this time the machine region we change to all 3d step and then we save and calculate okay this is the result so maybe I this one I changed color. Hmm. This and so you can see the difference. Um, one is use a uh, long and the other one is use all three D step.
this is used the all 3D step result. 